Hello YouTube! This is my response to Veritasium's video where he shoots a couple of wooden blocks with a bolt. Now, before watching this, watch his video, and before seeing the results of that video, try and make a guess about what's going on. Now, I have to admit, I accidentally saw the second video first, so it wasn't much of a surprise, the final answer. But still, you shouldn't spoil the surprise for yourself, so go check it out. So what's going on? Why do both blocks go to the same height despite one being spinning? Doesn't that violate conservation of energy in some way? And you're right, it does. See, there's two types of collision you need to worry about in physics. There's elastic collisions, where kinetic energy is conserved, and inelastic collisions, where energy, kinetic energy is not conserved. Now, the important thing about the bullet block experiment is that in both cases, a lot of energy is dissipated when the bullet hits the block. See, you lose a lot of energy having that hot metal burrowing into the hard wood. I know, dirty. But the important thing about both of these collisions is that they do conserve momentum. And since the initial velocity and mass of the bullets is the same, it means the final momentum of the bullet block system should also be the same. So they'll reach the same height. This does leave us with an interesting prediction. So in the case of the spinning block, because there's less energy for the bullet to burrow in because it's spinning, I'm betting that the bullet hasn't gone in as far. So the bullet block that went straight up, the bullet should go in farther than the, bullet, than the block that's spinning. That's my prediction. I don't know if Derek's going to do this measurement, but it would be cool to see if that's an important effect. I mean, impurities in the wood might change the result, but who knows. So, if you like physics-y and science-y videos, come check out my channel. Uh, if you really like what it is, subscribe. You might even figure out what this thing is if I ever get it done. Uh, this week's channel recommendation is for Shed Science, which is done by Sally Lepage. It's an awesome series of biology videos that's both entertaining and educational, and got quite a quirky sense of humor. So check that out here, and if you like my videos, subscribe here. Have a good day.